Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I hope you'll stick around by subscribing to my channel below. And if you're a returning subscriber, I thank you so much for continuing to watch my videos. So today we are starting the month of July. And you may hear something in the background. It's storming outside, so please excuse the rain if you can't hear it. Today I decided to use one of these stickers from Nubian Rock Chick, but the name of the site has actually changed. And this is by Cassie Manning. So she changed the name of her shop to Black Paper. She is now being referred to as Black Paper, but of course these are old stickers. So once I make a new purchase, the new name will be on there. And if you go to her site, that is the name of the site. So it's now called blackpaper.com. Do have out two washies. I have out my favorite, of course, which hasn't been out for a while, glitter washi. This is some red glitter washi. I believe I got from Target a while ago in the dollar spot. And this is the Fancy Plans AMXO collaboration flower or floral washi, black and white floral washi. So maybe using these. And I did bring out these stickers that I recently hauled in my Dollar Tree haul. These are by the Crafter Square and they're just some black, white, and gray stickers. And I have three sticker books out so far. I have the Happy Year, Sophisticated Florals, and the black and white sticker book. And these are all by the Happy Planner. All right, so of course, my layout of choice is the dashboard layout and this dashboard layout is by Fancy Plans Co. And I believe that's it. So let's go ahead and get started with this week's spread. All right, so I love to use the bigger version, of course, as always. So I'm going to use her, even though she is gigantic. <laughs> She does take up most of my page, but I'm still leaning towards using her. So I'm thinking she probably will do better in this corner here. All right, so I'm going to take the black and white sticker book and I believe I'm gonna take this print here and use it kind of as a background for her. I believe she's going to stand about here. So I think I'm going to stick the sticker right here. I'm going to take some of this washi and add it just across the top area here. Then go ahead and take the sticker and place her down on the page. Alright, so I'm not sure I'm feeling the red stripe like I thought I would, at least not up here. So I'm going to take it off. And I don't know, I was thinking maybe putting it down here. This area. So I'm going to cut it down to size. I'm 
actually I'm gonna do a whole new piece because I don't even like that one either. <laughs> so I'm gonna use it right here. Okay. And then here I'm gonna go back in the black and white sticker book. I'm gonna take this square and I'm actually gonna try to lift her back up. Hopefully she doesn't rip. And I'm gonna stick this box kind of on the side here next to her. Now I'm going to cut a strip of this floral washi, the black and white floral. And I'm going to see if it will work in this area up top. I'm going to take a bit of white out and white out these to do and these boxes and lines here. This is it's kind of see through this washi. Okay, so I'm gonna take the sophisticated florals and I like this box here with the flower detail. I'm kind of just going to connect it here. Somehow. So now I'm back in the black and white sticker book and I'm going to take this sticker that says attitude of gratitude and I'm actually going to cut it down and take off these little black and white stripes and I'm just going to add the quilt Actually, I'm going to chop it up even more, each individual word. going back in the sophisticated and it has like these little circles I want to call them and I'm just going to take the black ones okay so I decided to bring out wild style and I'm going to actually take this to do sticker and add it right next to these circles. So now I'm in the sophisticated florals and I'm going to take this. Day sticker. I'm just going to add it on top of this little flap on this note box here. I'm going to actually 
thin out this piece of washi. Just make it a smaller piece. Now, going back in the space can, I'm going to take an important sticker. We're going to add it to the bottom portion of this area here. Happy memory keeping. I'm just taking this July sticker. I'm just going to add it to the middle here. Okay, so now I'm in wild style and I want to take this today's top three sticker. I never use this as an actual functioning box. I kind of just always leave it as a decoration. But this time I'm going to try to make it functional. So I'm going to add this strip of glitter red washi here all right i'm actually gonna try these numbers they may be too big now that i'm looking at it but i'm gonna try it out first and see how i like it So that is pretty much it for this week's spread and I have to say that it was kind of a struggle with this one. I think it's because I wasn't sure what to do with her being so tall and this end I wanted to kind of do something different with using different shapes and kind of layering kind of differently this week so I think I did an okay job at that on this end. And then here, like I said, I wanted to try to use this as a functioning box instead of just using it as a decoration to write down my top three. And the big numbers, I don't think they look too bad. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep using them within a weekly layout. They may just be too big. I'm going to see how it works out with me writing in all my details for the week. But I hope you all enjoyed this video and I thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye guys. Thank you.